them always see the night. They say they want a real one. They say they want a real one to make them feel yo. Hey yo, what's good family? Welcome back to Astro Nori for another video. Today we're actually gonna be talking about the Supreme Week 1 drop list. Normally we have like a Supreme Week 0, Week 1 situation where on Thursday after the lookbook, they drop the in-store release, but then the following Monday they do the online release. This season they said fuck all that and they're putting it all together. Literally the first week is going online and in-store this Thursday, which is nuts. So I do wanna go ahead and cover it today. If you guys do end up enjoying this video you already know what to do man get this video to 150 likes for another video tomorrow where i talk about my 25 favorite pieces releasing from this entire season make sure you slap the like button down below subscribe to the channel if you are new and would enjoy more of this type of content also don't forget to click the post notification bells while you're down there so you're notified each and every time i post a new video but with all that being said man let's go ahead and get straight to it all right so i'm not even gonna lie bro there's a bunch of dookie stuff and then there's some good stuff in there too but it's just overwhelming i'm so glad that some of the pieces that i want aren't releasing this week so i can have a chance at getting them but we're gonna go ahead and talk about some of these items i typically cover it from the bottom going up but this time i'm gonna talk about it from the top going down because there's way too many good items starting off with these playing cards bro i hate the fact that these are the best item this week because i really do want to get these and honestly i might end up paying resale for it I feel like retail has to be around 16 to 20 dollars which is actually pretty good I do feel like these are gonna have some type of resale though along with a lot of these other items in here I just feel like there's a lot of potential and as time goes on I noticed that last season items from week one did really good long term so that's exactly why I'm splurging this week next up we got this verified tea which is low-key jokes because supreme is mocking us with the captchas if you know you know like bro when you're checking out they hit you with that captcha you already know what what happens after that so they decided to drop this verified tea right here which is actually not that bad the more i look at it the more i think it's actually not a bad idea it's just something different which is actually a good thing i feel like i'm gonna end up going for that as well we got the basketball which is low-key a vibe this was supposed to release last season but they held it back this is actually a high. I feel like retail might be a little too steep, but this money ball is lit, bro. Like, come on. Money ball is fire, bro. We got this Pharrell Sanders tee. I don't know how to feel about this tee, bro. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Like, this is cool. Like, I understand that some people are gonna vibe with this, but for me, bro, it's like a dub. I don't listen to jazz music like that. I understand they deserve the love. Switch it up a little bit and then come back to it. I understand, but it is what it is. End of the day, I'll probably end up picking it up, holding it to the side a little bit and end up flipping it in the future i would have loved to see like a cat williams or just some dope ass shit but it is what it is we got like this stash water bottle which is actually pretty fire this one's probably gonna come out for like 40 dollars, 45 something around that nature i feel like this is actually a fire ass bottle because you could just close this shit up once you're done drinking your water just close it up real quick boom stash it somewhere it's actually pretty clean but next up we probably got my favorite piece releasing this week and it is this fratura tea this shit is a vibe bro i really love this tee right here i love that fatura branding on the front i don't know if you guys know but fatura has collabed with supreme in the past like a couple times actually and they even released a box logo like in 06 or around that time that's going for like two thousand dollars right now that's why i feel like this tee is actually gonna do really good long term it's gonna have like that motion logo effect because people are gonna look into it a little bit more and realize that they have worked with this person before it does have that justice for all on the back then the supreme on the front definitely a clean ass piece i'll probably avoid getting it in this color but regardless it's probably one of my priorities this week besides the cards i really wish i could get this projector bro but at the end of the day this shit is going to retail for like seven eight hundred dollars and that's like my whole budget on what i'm trying to spend on week one so that's a dub low-key i'll be eye on that one i really hope that it's one of those bricks that people just let sit but i doubt it honestly i looked up the actual projector before the supreme collab and the shit is six hundred dollars so this is going to be steep as shit definitely want to see like a video on it so i can see the quality of the actual projector in itself because that's something that would be dope to have in the future you got this camo logo skate deck this shit is fire bro i love the blue one i love the woodland camo one and i love that black and white the most i feel like this is a piece that if you have it and you have all of them it just stacks really nicely but i definitely am a fan of that black and gray camo probably gonna have to come home with me i feel like i have a bunch of skate decks and when i have my own place i'm gonna 
lined them all up and it's gonna look so fire definitely looking forward to that but i'm trying to get the blue one and the black one i feel like these will do good resale wise probably not at first but as time goes on these prices will go up we got this icy arc hooded sweatshirt this one's pretty clean in the gray color besides that it's a dub gray and blue go really nice together and to me it represents like a icy vibe if that makes sense i definitely do like that gray color but besides that i think that one is a dub it might end up doing good but who knows to be honest we do have the backpacks coming out which low-key i feel like are pretty clean and i am in need of a backpack and i would also love to do a review for you guys so i might debate on getting the olive or the black book bag i feel like they're clean they're nothing too special but it's just simple subtle another good iteration of a bag in my opinion and it's something that you can actually use so i'll probably end up getting that i'm debating on it honestly because there's so much shit releasing that i just don't know but i do want to say that if you guys are interested in checking out on some of these items in the near future you should definitely go ahead and check out addict io addict io is an ios bot which basically covers 85 different stores from kids supreme Bape, undefeated they recently added yeezy supply and adidas on there so you could cook up on yeezys but their main focus is supreme and they end up cooking up every single week so i definitely would recommend you guys to go ahead and check them out if you are interested in boosting your chances i wouldn't say don't go manual i would just say go manual and also have the bot on the side so you could go ahead and have the best results possible if you guys are interested in checking out this bot whenever they do restock again go ahead and check out addict.io and sign up for their newsletter once they do release the restock you will get notified and that way you can go ahead and check it out you can also use my promo code astro for 10 percent off so you can get it for a cheaper price and if you can't afford it you can also split it into four payments using sezzle which is really convenient because if you cook up on some of these items it pays for itself addict.io is actually super easy to set up all you have to do is go on discord they give you the keywords on there you put it in the bot insert what color what size your payment information and then you set up your tasks and that's all you have to do bro and i feel like it's something you should definitely go ahead and check it out hey just go ahead and click it see what's up with it and see what's up just see what's up so we got this little headlamp coming out this is like a strong ass led with like a headband around it this is i i am not the person who rides a bike in the woods in central park at night type shit so i'll be eye on this like i'm gooch on this piece right here like what do i look like just walking around with a headlamp not me bro that's for caucasian fathers only I'm good on that. We got this watch plate, which what the fuck? They should have just made a watch, like a clock. We would have been all right with a clock. Why do we need a plate with it? <laughs> I'm good on that one too. I'm gonna just leave that one right there. We got this balloons tee, which low key did grow on me a little bit. I am a fan of this black colorway because the balloons pop on it. <laughs> Get it? Balloons pop on it. Somewhere deep down in my heart. Gay. But the balloons pop out more on it. So I am kind of a fan of it. Definitely feel like I would buy this and just hold it off see what happens with the prices in the long run low key this season i am trying to sell a lot of supreme so make sure you go ahead and follow astro bodega because a lot of things will be for sale i'm gonna pick and choose this season what i want to keep uh -uh. i got a lot of shit that i really don't even wear we got these jet skateboards there's three different ones and once again like i said before with the camo ones if you buy all three of these shits and you set it up it looks really fire so i am a fan of these i don't know which one i would get probably like the black or the red both of them are pretty cool in my opinion i gotta see bro because i really want the camel one more i really wish these would have released at separate dates but that's not the case a lot of these items that i've talked about might go ahead and do good resale wise in the long run but i'm honestly gonna skip through a little bit there's some items that i don't really care about too much we got the smurfs trucker jacket which it's all right bro the trucker jacket could have been better in my opinion i just feel like the denim that they decided to use just looks like i'm about to drive a 16 wheeler like i'm good on that shit bro they could have definitely chose like a light denim this is ass like i'm not gonna lie i'm not gonna sugarcoat it this shit is cheeks we got this gore-tex s logo six panel this is i right. we do got this waist bag right here which is actually fire i'm not even the type of person to wear waist bags on the regular but i feel like this one isn't bad definitely in this like olive color that's probably my favorite color for the bags this season i feel like down the line this one might end up doing good low key the cheetah print might be the one to do best resell wise because a lot of girls love cheetah print and a lot of girls love wearing this type of bag so who knows bro i feel like the olive and the cheetah print are the colors that stand out you can never go wrong with red when it comes to supreme as well but i'm gonna go ahead and talk about some of these tees we got the nueva york tee which is kind of like the dominique tee that released last season it's kind of the same shit i might end up picking it up just to hold 
pulled it off like I said before it's all right it's nothing over the top in my opinion I definitely like this jet T way more this one's actually fire I wonder if the same shit that happened on the skate decks was like a different plane the different crash different font would happen when you change the color of the T that would actually be really cool in my opinion we got this s logo fitted which is probably one that I would end up going for I already have a s logo six panel so I would love a fitted and low key I've been getting into fitted a little bit more lately so I might end up trying to go for this one depending on the price we also have this lovers tee which is pretty fire I definitely love this green that's on there shit is hard bro I'm gonna try to go for that hands down I feel like when it comes to tees resell after time passes will go up just mark my words on that we got this sling bag which is something that they typically don't even do so I feel like it might do good but at the end of the day who's really wearing something like this if you want to wear something like this you got the waist bag and you just tuck it over the top and it's a little bit more sleek so I kind of don't know how I feel about this we got probably one of my favorite pieces which is the smurfs Gore-Tex parka this shit is crazy I love that camo colorway and I love the black one as well if I could get this the cards and the futurity I don't need nothing else this week bro like low-key those are the three items that I would love to keep this week besides that everything else could pretty much go bro like I'm good this jacket is hard I feel like a lot of people are sleeping on it and as time goes on this shit will go up in price definitely that camo and the black colorway those are both hard in my opinion we got this big arc crew neck and we got the beanie as well the crew neck is fire I definitely am a fan of the gray if I'm not mistaken because that one actually changes color as the crew neck goes the other ones are just like a flat color but the gray one does change all throughout the actual crew neck which is actually a pretty clean touch we got this multi logo t this one's kind of cheesy I'm not even gonna lie bro this one just got every supreme logo on that bitch I might go ahead and buy it because you know hype beast like that but I'm not I don't think I like that one too much to be honest we got the portrait hooded sweatshirt this is another one where I don't know how to feel it has the little supreme branding on the top then homie in the portrait is wearing a supreme hat if there is a color that would do good it's that baby pink colorway we got this blowback rayon shirt this one is definitely fire in that black colorway to me I feel like the yellow with the blue is something you wear more in the spring summertime but realistically who's gonna be wearing a rayon in the fall and winter definitely not me we got this Futura logo five panel that shit is hard I honestly don't even have that many snapbacks and this is one that I would want to have so I'm gonna try and see what's going on because there's a lot of shit that I said I want to have from this week and my pockets don't agree so I'm gonna go ahead and figure that shit out but besides everything that I covered so far there's a couple more items that are I like the stay positive tea I feel like a lot of people are sleeping on that one and I'm the type of person who really believes what this shirt says so I might go ahead and pick it up and camo because I don't have any camo tees as well there's a bunch of dookie ass items at the bottom bro like this hounds tooth shit is weak juice bro this piping track jacket is straight garbage bro like shit is trash cans out here like i'm good bro there's a bunch of dookie ass shit we got the tire t as well which is why why did they do this shit bro like it doesn't make no sense it looked like you would wear this with a smurfs jacket hop in your 16 wheeler and drive for 12 hours like bro nah i'm good on this shit that pretty much does it for this video if you guys did enjoy slap a fat like on this one down below subscribe to the channel if you are new would enjoy more of this type of content comment what kind of videos you would like me to make in the comments as well and low-key i'm trying to get back in the mojo of filming i have been like on and off it's about time to go hard again and that's exactly exactly what we about to do slap a like 150 likes and i'll have a brand new video for you guys tomorrow come on son 150 200 likes i know y'all could do it subscribe to the channel if you are new click on post notification bells and with all that being said man i hope you guys have a great day i wish you the best of luck with the supreme release and i'm gonna catch y'all on the next one peace stay up and i'm out they say they want a real one, they say they want a real one to make them feel young.